Oh, it's got one. Oh, he dropped it? Nope. Got him. <laughs> All right, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. So we're out here on Table Rock Lake once again. Just got back from Lake of the Ozarks. I hope you guys check out that video. It was an awesome tournament. Uh, we didn't place where we wanted to place necessarily, but I had fun. Never fished that lake before, and, and we, we, you know, we just overcame some stuff. And I had a great time, but anyways, go back and check that out. Check that video out. Uh, we're back here on Table Rock Lake, and it is pouring down rain. It's not... I guess it's not really pouring down rain, but it's it's coming down pretty dang good. It's been coming down all morning long. Uh, this is going to be an evening fishing uh, session. It's noon right now. Um, I've been working all morning, trying to just working to get out here and to go fishing. Um, I haven't even unloaded anything yet. I didn't want to do the intro and with the rain out there and whatnot. But anyways, guys, I'm going to go ahead and get the kayak unloaded and uh, do some fishing. We're down here on the lower end of the lake. We're pretty much on the Arkansas border. Uh, right now uh, so I haven't fished this part of the lake in over a year uh, surprisingly enough as much as I fish table rock I haven't been down in this area in a really long time so I just wanted to come down here and check it out and see what's going on in this area so anyways guys I'm gonna get the kayak unloaded and we'll see you guys out on the water all right There's something actually kind of kind of peaceful about being out here on a kayak in the rain. Just this light sprinkle like this. It's not bad. All right, time to get to work. Let me toss this jig around for a second. First cast. I don't pay attention to the weather nearly as good as I should, but I looked at it today and it really made me super depressed. We're supposed to have chances of rain for the next eight days pack a baba on a wet line we just trying to get a good time No, no. Got me in the bushes. Come out of there. There he goes. That's a good one. That's a good one. I don't have a net. Come here, buddy. That's a good one. Oh, yeah, buddy. That's what I'm talking about. Those are the ones we're after right there. Comes right out. Look at that. Beautiful fish. 16 and a half. But a fun, fun bite. Thank you, sir. We appreciate it. Gosh, I need to tighten up my drag. <laughs> Did you guys hear that thing squealing? Goodness gracious. Ooh, there was one that followed it up. I wonder if I can get him. Watch this. A really good sized one that just kind of followed it all the way up to the boat didn't figure it was gonna make a swipe at it but seeing a couple roamers now that's good not that's good news right there I'm wondering if there'd be a moving bait that would work well too Gosh dang it. Oh well. Well, it's got one. Little guy. Come here, buddy. Little spot of bass. 
Come here, buddy. Oh, okay. Don't get feisty on me now. Oh, man, it's actually a nice, healthy one. Honestly. Okay. Nice. Well, I guess we'll measure. We'll do our we'll do our longest five today if we catch five. Fourteen. We got a sixteen and a quarter and a fourteen. I wish we had these fish like the Ozarks, but oh well. Thank you, sir. Making a lot of ruckus. I think it's what there's some fish on bed and just some some roamers around the area. So, like I said, I think that this is. I think this here is a pretty good little pattern. There we go. Man, he annihilated that one. I don't think he's hooked very good. Oh, he got off. Dang it. Got off. Dang it. Hmm. Dang it. We are fish we're fishing sloppy, folks. We are fishing really sloppy. I mean, that would lost two, caught two. Oh well, I guess that's fishing though. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What is going on? I saw him come up and get that one. Oh my gosh. I tell you what, this creek arm back here just sets up perfectly for this time of year. Steep bank, chunk rock with some little pebble rock mixed in. Clear water. I mean, can't ask for much more right now. This time of year, way back in here. I'm actually curious about something. I know it's pretty much right smack in the middle of the day, but never know if you don't try. So, and I'm seeing some fry busting. So maybe, get one on a popper, huh? Okay, maybe we'll come back. That's not good. That's really not good. My phone's been sitting in water. Got one. Oh, he dropped it? Nope. Got one, got one, got one. Man, they're so close up to this, this flooded brush and whatnot. Popped it. Gosh dang it, Mitchell. Gosh dang it, why are these fish not staying pinned? Let me know in the comments, guys, what am I doing wrong? I mean, I'm not torquing them too hard. I'm ah, I'm just starting to get irritated at this point. Fishing so sloppy. There we go. Stay pinned. don't jump, don't jump. See, spit it. really starting to lose my cool here folks i'm not a pro fisherman by any means not even close to the sort but you'd think i'd be able to at least get a couple fish in the boat I wonder if i can get those fish to bite they do seem pretty locked on Got him. <laughs> God. Oh. Golly. That was fun. Sight fishing. Saw the two just chilling on a bed. Tossed my Senko over there. Man, what the heck? This fish engulfed it. Mean, too. Fish number, is this number three, I guess? Fish number three. On a bed up here. 13 and a quarter. 13 and a quarter. Thank you, sir. That was fun. Or ma'am. Could have been a ma'am. I'm not sure. Is 
Stay down, stay pinned. Doesn't feel too big, but. Nah, just a little. Just a little largey. Oh, there we go. Thank you, sir. Number four. What do we. I think, yeah, this is number four. Oh, there he goes. I guess we'll never know. <laughs> oh, man. There we go, just a little guy, a little feisty guy. Oh, little bitty guy. 11 and three quarters. 11 and three quarters. That's fish number four, I guess, that we've actually gotten to uh, measure. So thank you, sir. Shoop. There's a better one. Stay pinned. Stay pinned. Oh my. <sighs> Folks. Got us one. Got us one. Stay pinned. Stay pinned. Just a little bitty guy. Stay pinned. Number five, there's our limit. 13 and three quarters. Not a big one, but shh, I mean, limit. Thank you, sir. There we go. Oh my lordy. <sighs> There we go. Oh my gosh, he let go of it. There he is, he's back. Fighter, we got a fighter, please don't get off. That's a good one. That's a good one. That's a good one. Yes, sir. Okay. Right at 15. So, just a fair one. Not anything crazy. Just a fair one. Thank you, sir. The Cinco bite continues, unfortunately. There we go. Ooh. Kind of feels a wee bit better. I don't want to twerk. No. You're not going to jump. He jumped anyways. Uh. There we go. He's not very really long. He's not a very good kayak bass, but he's got a big old chomper on him. Oh yeah, 14 inches. He's been caught before too, because that is not my hook, hook hole there. I got him down there. He's been caught a time before. So, just a hungry little largemouth. All right, thank you, sir. Oh, a 
little bitty spotted bass. Whoa. Oh. Just a little 12 incher. Thanks for the bite, buddy. Appreciate you. Like that one. Just like that. Oh, he came off. Dang it. Little guy. Oh my gosh. Why are they not sticking? That's three bites and like four casts. Whoa, big bite. He's not hooked very good. Oh, what the heck? That was an awesome bite. I love it when they just annihilate these things. Gosh, he just absolutely clapped it. 14 and a half. Skinny, but long. Man, that was a fun bite. He destroyed that Senko. Thank you, sir. We're just going to chalk it up to they're just kind of nipping at it. Small fish are just kind of grabbing the tail and... Oh, another one. Same spot, next cast. Got a jumper on our hands, folks. Oh, eh, we'll get him to go 13 and a half. 13 and a half out there on a bed, just guarding it. I'll put him right back on his bed. Thank you, sir. Oh, I got one. Oh my gosh, I was on my phone. Oh no. He choked. As I'm saying, he choked and he gets off. What the heck? Ah. Oh. oh my gosh. Dude, this little cove is loaded with fish. I mean, like, legit. <laughs> He's not big. He's not going to help him. I'm not going to board him. But I'm telling you, like, loaded. All right, we're not even going to measure him. Don't think it'll help, but thank you for anyways for the bite. We do appreciate you. All right, and I think that's probably going to be the last fish of the day. I think we're going to call it right there. All right, folks. Well... That was a fun day, fun evening adventure. Sun's starting to go down. It's about seven o'clock right now. We spent a pretty decent amount of time out here on the water. Caught some decent fish, had some really bad luck. I mean, we, our landing percentage in the boat was so bad, like 25%. I mean, it's it's been, you know, we all miss fish, it's part of it, but today just seemed exceptionally bad. But it is what it is. I had an awesome time. Uh, the fish really just wanted that Cinco so bad. So bad, guys. It, it, they were way up shallow, back tucked up in this flooded brush. Like I said, the water is up a few feet. Uh, we've been getting a lot of rain. We're supposed to continue to get a lot of rain. So it's just, they were chewing. As soon as that sun came out, it slowed down. I snuck back in this cove. I only made it like 50 yards in this cove. And uh, I'm just going to call it right here. I'll probably come back here in the next couple days. I don't want to beat these fish up too bad. But anyways, guys, had an awesome time. Thank you guys for watching today's video. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe. I put out two videos a week, and uh, we'd love to have you on board. But uh, anyways, guys, uh, I'm peacing out, signing out, and we will see you all in the next one.